आमची मुंबई स्वच्छ ठेवावी ही आमची क्षमता ताट तुम तुम ता येतो आम्हाला थर्टी सेकंड इन दोज डेज देर वॉज नो कॉन्टेंट सो दे वर डाईंग फॉर कॉन्टेंट ऑडियन्स इज नेवर रॉंग विशाल दर्लाइन टोल मी दिस ऑडियन्स इज नेवर रॉंग एव्हरी क्वेश्चन टू एव्हरी प्रॉब्लेम इज ऑलरेडी सॉल्व्ड अँड नाव यू हॅव टूल्स ऑल वेटिंग इट्स गोन बी द क्रिएटिव्ह वे इन विच यू टेक दिस टूल अँड दिस टूल अँड सॉल्व अन अदर काइंड अँड अनदर लीग ऑफ प्रॉब्लेम्स बट युअर रेपो is now decided by the spotify playlist editor are you understanding where your career is at so if one goes into a herd mentality acha bhi arji chal rahe to arji to wala gaate hai sab usme aap phas jaoge volleyball khel raha hu ye sab sab chal raha hai acha come i want to talk to you about something india's first and only boy band so if you're not vibing with a fellow artist slash audience slash whoever and you're making music only for yourself why are you doing it तो ही टेल्स मी सर बहुत अच्छा गाना है लेकिन आपके स्पॉटीफाई पे तो फोर्टी फाइव लिस्नर्स है बोला तो 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 ही सेट सर ऐसा नहीं चलेगा मैं बोला यार तुमने गोल पोस्ट चेंज कर दिया Namaste and welcome to Music Mehfil India. Our guest today is the extremely charming Sherin Vergis, who has been a singer, a musician, a model, a celebrity, an actor, and also an entrepreneur for about thirty years now. <laughs> okay, so how are you? Mr Vergis Mr Vergis is my father's name <laughs> I am Sherin because I'm a Malayali mm. and we take on our father's mm. name that's why it is Sherin Vergis and uh, it is an honor to be here on your show Music Mehfil and uh, I've been watching your growth this is I believe the 16th episode yeah uh, I don't 17th know. I don't know I don't know what yeah. am I in number but I've I've had many links which you send diligently every <laughs> every spam week you know <laughs> no that's okay be a spammer that's how this thing grows okay and mm. it uh, to answer your question i feel very nice and mm. it feels really really nice that somebody tells me that a charming man called <laughs> sherin burgi is sitting in front of you i am really trying to understand 30 years it feels like yesterday <laughs> you know how did it begin um music has always been there mm-hmm. school church choir mm-hmm. the fact that it take a serious turn only happened in college I was listening to a lot of rock music, okay, and uh, the rock bands got a little better. Won a couple of mood eyes, best vocalists, mm-hmm. and then like I started looking at life. Ki chalo yar, gaane to banana hi raha hoon roj. ठीक है, time pass हो रही है. And uh, rock bands are also doing fine. And I started living in New Bombay, which is where my college was. It was quite quite a fun life. Did everything that a teenager would do. Mm-hmm. Uh, I was very good at engineering, okay, and. Uh, little before that 10th standard and to post 10th standard and stop going to the andrews or the zaviers i mm-hmm. went to diploma in mechanical engineering mm-hmm. and i aced it okay till that time i was a cherubic boy very nice mama's boy theek mm-hmm. hai and my growth spurt happened after diploma which is after 4 years of college so that's like 11 12 13 14 uske mm-hmm. baad i went to degree engineering in datta migis college of engineering and now you enter degree second year directly mm-hmm. ab degree second year mein ye ho jata hai ki matlab i am already the cats whisker mm-hmm. because humko प्रैक्टिकल भी आता है बिकॉज वी आर फ्रॉम लास्ट एंड टू ब्रो इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी जहाँ पे मतलब इंडस्ट्री इंटीग्रेटेड कोर्स है वी नो एवरीथिंग एंड इट यूज टू मेरे ये बहुत यू नो इट वॉज लाइक माई टीचर्स इन एल टी आई टी ड्यूरिंग माई डिप्लोमा वो स्टनिंग एंड इन डिग्री वर ऑल इंडस्ट्री रिजेक्ट सो वी इज टू कॉल इट आउट एज इट इज बोलते थे कि मतलब ये इंडस्ट्री रिजेक्ट हमको कैसे कहेंगे ये वो दिल दैट वो तो अच्छा बेटा इंडस्ट्री रिजेक्ट वाई वा फेल वाई वा फेल वाई वा फेल ऐसा उसने करते करते मतलब मेरी जिंदगी जो रही नाइनटी फोर टू नाइनटी एट थोड़ा गेयर डाउन होने लगा थोड़ा बैंड सीन बढ़ने लगा थोड़े बाल बढ़ने लगे यू नो थोड़े बीड्स एंड थोड़े रॉक स्टार लाइफ थोड़ी जीने लगे somewhere around 99 which mm. is third year of engineering and i had only about 6 months to finish it with a lot of kts i got this opportunity for to be the front man for the rubber band on movers and shakers ah so that's what changed my life and this came to me because the bassist clever menezes mm-hmm. if you know clever okay yeah. i was vocalist for his band called mm-hmm. rust angels Ah and we were that whole raspberry rhinoceros gang not just right. jazz by the bay we were that lot mm-hmm. you understand so he said baba listen that sharia rata you know from that more than shakers okay he's leaving mm-hmm. and he needs 
a replacement because his bakery business is going down and he needs he's like so shari like no sells confectionery bread to taj wahan so he's a big man doing mm. guitar and music for fun and i was like getting really tired with industry rejects teaching me engineering where mm. they didn't know and i was the champ in engineering drawing and strength of mechanics and kinematics <laughs> and i had all of these things working for me but i just didn't see the system evolving mm. 2000 y2k bug was coming out where mm. we were the yakfa fail gayi thi ki matlab को ये चले जाने वाला क्या बोलते हैं वाई टू के बग आने वाला है आप सारे मैकेनिकल वाले सब लूट जाने वाले हो इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स इज गोनो टेक ओवर द वर्ल्ड ऑल कंप्यूटर्स आर गोनो रीसेट एंड यू ऑल आर गोनो जस्ट लूज योर जॉब सो वी वर अंडर दिस इंप्रेशन दैट मैकेनिकल इज गोनो गो डाउन एंड आई स्पेशलाइज इन ऑटोमोबाइल एंड हाइड्रोलिक सो आई डेंट सी अ फ्यूचर इन इंजीनियरिंग Wow. In comes this golden opportunity in the form of movers and shakers. Okay, so for those who may not remember, movers and shakers was an interesting, very funny, very popular talk show in its time, hosted by the incredible Shaker Suman, who used to do an amazing, amazing uh, mimicry of Lalu Prasad Yadav. Yes, do it, do it, do it. Yes. Yeah, and they had a live studio band. Correct. Yeah. Correct. They had a live studio mm-hmm. band called the Rubber Band, and uh-huh. I was. शेरिन एंड शेर शारी का बेटा शारियार का बेटा शारी का बेटा शेरी ओके तो शेरी शेरी करते बोले शेरी क्या कर रहे हो तो ये शेखर भाई जो है ना ही कुड नॉट प्रोनाउंस मैं नहीं शेरिन ही सुको शरीन शरौन आई आई लिव विद शरीन शरौन ऑल दैट ड्यूरिंग माई स्कूल लाइफ सो लेट्स मेक इट अ लिटिल कूल एट दैट टाइम शाहरुख करते ये बोलते थे कि ना बड़ो शाहरुख खान जैसा होना चाहिए तो मैं बोला यार ये क्या करो तो मैं बोला सर शाहरुख नहीं करते हैं शेरी शेरो तो शेरोकी Oh. तो उन्होंने बोल दिया कि मैंने बोला सर क्लासिक करते जीप चरोकी करते चरोकी करते ठीक है ही कुड नेवर से चरोकी से शाहरुखी एंड दराबा बैंड टाका दुगु दुगे दिश दिस इज व्हाट वी शुड डू एंड दैट नेम स्टक या दैट नेम स्टक आई लिव विद इट फॉर 2 इयर्स एंड आई वाज डूइंग 2 इयर्स एंड आई डिड वेरी वेल ड्यूरिंग दैट पीरियड दिस वाज 99 मेरी साढ़े सती जस्ट खत्म हो गई थी एंड 2000 वाज हैपनिंग न्यू ईयर वाज हैपनिंग तो मेरा इंजीनियरिंग वेंट आउट ऑफ द ब्रैक एंड दैट इज व्हेन माय वाइफ सेड बेबी तू कर तेरे को जो करना है तू कर तेरे को जो करना है मैं हूं एंड मेरी बेबी फुल पड़ाकू तो ये करते करते आई रिमेंबर हर बींग द रॉक इन माई लाइफ वेर आई सेट बेब आई वॉन्ट टू लाइक परस्यूम म्यूजिक आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू गो बैक टू दिस आठ हजार रुपया पर महीना जॉब ओके बिकॉज आई एम हैविंग सो मच फन आई मीन आई यूज टू मेक वन सॉन्ग अ मंथ एंड आई यूज टू लाइक एन्जॉय विद माई बैंड एंड फोर्स दम इन टू प्रोड्यूसिंग यूर हैव टू राइट अ सॉन्ग एवरी डे बिकॉज दैट सॉन्ग रिक्वायर्ड ओरिजिनल म्यूजिक बिकॉज आई एज गोइंग टू ट्वेंटी फाइव डिफरेंट कंट्रीज सो आई कॉन्ट पिक एनी अदर सॉन्ग आई टू मेक एन ओरिजिनल सॉन्ग वॉट फन वन डे आई मेकिंग अ सॉन्ग अबाउट अ लीफ विच वेल इन द बैल्कनी आई एम सॉन्ग मेकिंग सॉन्ग अबाउट माई सिस्टर आई मेकिंग सॉन्ग अबाउट द शू दट आई एम वेरिंग इट्स सो मच फन सो मच टॉपिक्स वन डे द प्रोड्यूसर द शो कम्स एंड टेल मी सर कल ना वो एंटी थुकू डे सो थुको ना थुको ना थुको ना थुको ना थुको ना थुको ना आमची मुंबई स्वच्छ ठेवावी ही आमची क्षमता या हा पान तंबाकू आता नका 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 या तू कना मना है बस अब यही दुआ है इसे अपना घर समझ कर तू थूक ना बन कर थूक ना का थूक ना का थूक ना का खा थूक ना का थूक ना का थूक ना का आमची मुंबई स्वच्छ ठेवावी ही आमची क्षमता आमची मुंबई स्वच्छ ठेवावी ही आमची क्षमता ता तू दुम दुम ता ये तो हमारा 30 सेकंड दिस इज द काइंड ऑफ कंटेंट वी आई एम सो मच फन Yeah, and we have very talented musician. Ben had perfect pitch. Wow. Yeah. So I laughter in B sharp. Sorry, <laughs> B sharp. <laughs> okay. So this used to be the kind of yeah. things that used to happen. One day it's a Talwin Singh that I'm jamming with. Second day is a Zakir Bai. Mm. Third day is MC Hammer. So you, you, have these gods and legends are coming. You know, and one day is Vishal Dadlani as a guest. Yeah. And these same two cool musicians or artists or models or millions of humans of the world, I'm meeting at night party. Karte. Suddenly I'm elevated. my head sense my sensibility yeah. of the world is like wow fuck engineering you know what i'm saying so yeah. that's what that's where it started and that's the journey and from that point onwards when did band of boys happen so i did this for 2 years uh-huh. i did moves and shakers for 2 years it was great fun then came a competing show on sony called jito chappad bhadke Yeah. Hosted by Govinda. Yeah, yeah, yeah. तो हर साल हमारे को एक महीना ब्रेक देते थे बोलते सेट तोड़ रहे नया सेट ला रहे शेखर पाजी नया गेस्ट आया न्यू जूस नया जूस हम लोग सब तो वेकेशन कर रहे हैं अभी mm. एक महीना एक महीना दो महीना हो गया हाँ सेट बन रहा है दो महीने का तीन महीना हो गया हम लोग सबकी फटी जा रही है mm. तब भी हमारे टाइम पे पंद्रह हजार का सैलरी आता था इट वॉज ह्यूज पंद्रह हजार का सैलरी मेरे पर नोकिया का फोन था बनाना वाला डेढ़ लाख Wow, really? Yeah, 20 years ago, no? Yeah. Perhaps a little more. Hmm. 
शरू की मैं आपसे बहुत प्यार करती हूँ सोनी इज गिविंग मी अ बंडल एवरी वीक इमेजिन रश I'm an engineering student. Nobody who's just like you know a rock star dude and all that. Suddenly you are on TV five days a week, hmm. and your friends are calling. Hey, Charuki. Hey, Charuki. Hey, Charuki. <laughs> this is what's happening. And who are my friends? Sid Kuto, Dadlani. Hmm. These yeah. are my pals. You understand? We're yeah. all struggling to do something. Else. So this happens and it continues for a while. Two years happens and the next third leg is supposed to start. Uh huh. Doesn't happen because Ravina Tandon from Sony, not the Ravina Tandon, the actor. Yeah. Ravina Tandon, Sony, hmm. something, something. Hmm. Brings in a new show with Govinda as a host, which takes on this prime time slot of Shikhar mm. Suman. Shikhar Suman is destroyed. With him, we are destroyed <laughs> completely. Yeah. So we didn't know what to do. We were like, okay, up kya karu? I don't want to go back to engineering. Mm-hmm. Bivi ko pucha kya karu? Or bivi tere ko kya karna hai? Mm. Uh, Meko yeah, 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 Hmm. And my first folio, I forget the guy, Sunil Nair. Hmm. He put a brilliant for- portfolio of mine. Okay, and both. This is what a visual portfolio. Oh, yeah, a photo ah. uh, like portfolio for modeling. Ah. Okay. अभी T V पे तो आ गए ना अभी मतलब इसी T V से काम लेने के लिए मतलब खुद सब यही पूछे सर folio भेजिए. ठीक है तो अभी फोलियो क्या होता है अच्छा ये होता है चलो फोलियो बनाते हैं फोलियो बनाया बीवी का भी फोलियो बनाया हम दोनों का एक मतलब husband and wife type ऐसा और एक बना दिया. बाँट दिया. पहले time में मेरे को बालाजी से call आया. Hmm. So, Ekta Kapoor calls me for this serial called Koi Apna Sa. Hmm. Narayani Shastri and I pitted against each other, the lead couple. Khatam. Hmm. <laughs> Suddenly, I am like a serial boy. Meri puri colony me aise elevated status ho gayi. ठीक है. Somebody who comes as like a musician on Movies and Shakers five days a week. Hmm. Now I am every day on national television with Z, and it is going to international UK, Dubai, Hawaii, sab jagah. Not that Movies and Shakers was not. Yeah. But then suddenly now I am a Namaste, my name is Tushar. How are you, Jia? Come here. Hmm. Okay, so full acting is happening. I boy loved next it. door. Boy next door, sweet yeah. mama boy, and hmm. all the aunties and uncles and everybody wanted photos with me. Hmm. Again, another elevated status. Brilliant. Hmm. Did that for six months. Get a call from Karan Obray. Hmm. He had come as a guest on Movies and Shakers. So yeah. I knew him as a singer. Clever was producing the music for his album. Hmm. So that's how I kind of knew him. क्या कर रहा है वो? नो ना वॉलीबॉल खेल रहा हूँ. ये सब सब चल रहा है. अच्छा. Come, I want to talk to you about something. India's first and only boy band. Hmm. His neighbour Sudhanshu Pandey. <laughs> okay. Huh. So Sudhanshu Pandey, him and I, three of hmm. us. Hmm. Not bad. We all kind of look alike. <laughs> In लोग क्या गाएंगे? A Pandey sings very well, Kishore and Mohammad Rafi. That's it. ठीक hmm. है. <laughs> Karan Obray sings only in ground floor. Hmm. That's it. limited range main 11th floor theek hai to we were not bad we could form something this guy has got a great voice this guy is we can do harmony romney you know that we'll figure it out then he tells me that mm-hmm. i have been speaking to vinod nair from clear public relations mm-hmm. who had put an idea to him tera album produce karna hai karan obray get me five boys like you the hunt starts ncpa mein word of mouth audition where some 400 600 aspirants turn up what yeah This oh. was way before television took on anything. And this is just word of mouth. Exactly by word of mouth. Wow. Okay, four hundred to six hundred participants over a period of two to three days. Hmm. Is me say six of them made the cut. Hmm. That is where Chintu Bosle came in. Sadat hmm. Haldipur came in. Darren Das came in. Hmm. Then started this whole grind, where okay, the, and this was hosted by Hari Bhai and by Leslie Lewis. Vinod Nair was handling Colonial Cousins. Hmm. So it was predefined that Leslie sir is going to be doing a music for music, sure. Yeah. Two years from that point onwards was like trial and error. I remember this first interview by Narendra Kusnur when hmm. Vinod Nair launched us at the Taj, mm-hmm. saying India's first boy band. Yeah. Litmus test begins. Okay. This was yeah, an article. That does sound like Narendra. Yeah. Full power. Yeah. And this article is still there in my like you know it's one mm-hmm. of my in my wall of fame. It is there at my house. Okay. And mm-hmm. I remember this whole thing where we were this whole. picturesque handsome looking boy band we could all sing yeah and the requirement is very clear everybody mm-hmm. has to sing everybody has to be able to hold an audience yeah. we all have to be orators charming snakes mm-hmm. as you call it mm-hmm. okay <laughs> and mm-hmm. and be able to act and sing and entertain uh-huh. you don't have to be like mm-hmm. excellent at one thing you have to be like above average on all mm-hmm. then starts the training then binod nai put this whole thing together mm-hmm. roz do saal mai मलाड़ सुबह निकलता था छः बजे सात बजे बैंड्रा पहुँचते थे उसका गुलाम मुस्तफ़ा खां के बड़े भाई कादिर खान से रियाज सीखने दैट्स द फर्स्ट टाइम आई गॉट इन टू क्लासिकल ट्रेनिंग 
बिकॉज दैट वॉज जस्ट लाइक आई कैन सिंग हाई और लो ठीक है तो वो चल रहा था रियाज खत्म होता था कुछ आठ बजे वहां से वापस जुहू एंड दिस इज ऑल ऑफ अस ऑल ऑफ अस टुगेदर दस बजे हम पहुंचते थे विजय अलवा के साथ इंडियन कोच का फिजिकल फिजियोथेरापिस्ट एट जुहू फॉर वर्कआउट उसके बाद हम पहुंचते थे एक बजे महालक्ष्मी की ब्रिज के नीचे देर वॉज क्लियर पब्लिक रिलेशन का ऑफिस वहां पे ही स्टूडियो सेटअप लाइक अ गो डाउन वे वी वुड लाइक गैदर टुगेदर इट डब्बा एंड देन ऑन वन ओ क्लॉक वन थर्टी वी विल स्टार्ट रिहर्सल्स How dance sweet lessons you and dabba. rehearsals yeah we hmm. all carry dabba and hmm. we all like and mind you this is around the time when like we were uh ye serial serial chal raha hai aur hmm. uske beech mein humko kaise time banana hai hmm to karte 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 okay ha somebody is able to come at this time somebody is not able to come at this time some uh, aisa karte 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 we were reaching a point where now the music was being produced side by side the boys are getting trained in all dances we had done about some 16 17 acts and it was a long exactly like a play Hmm. Okay, whoever well, somebody is missing it, somebody is coming on time, somebody is not coming on time. I say, करते करते करते, we're reaching this position where the band is getting set. Hmm. Then we know that the first contract is low. Hmm. Remove all allied contracts, remove all allied careers. You can now only do a band of boys. Four into two, that's eight year career, water tight contract. Amari phad gayi. I remember calling Bobby Talwar. Hmm. Who was into law? Yeah. Right. I gave him my contract. He said, bro, ये तो मतलब रोज रात को हम लोग पूछते थे महालक्ष्मी ब्रिज के ऊपर एल्बम कब आएगा कब आएगा कब आएगा कब आएगा एंड देन वन फाइन डे विनोद नायर बॉट इन को प्रोड्यूसर बाय द नेम मनु कुमार फिल्म प्रोड्यूसर फ्रॉम दाउथ ही Marlon Rodriguez on board and Mary Neen happened the video mm. the white on white video yeah yeah and when that video happened in the next video which happened which is ishq the first black and white song in the pop in the history of india indie pop mm. in our country i mean that is something if you can look at as a history of yeah then came rezi if you know who rezi is a very prolific uh, ad film director mm. okay and a feature film director now okay mm. he made gori then yeah. gori ke baad she drives me crazy the first first song which had the actual indian rugby team in it and rugby as a sport was documented in a music video for the first time so there were many firsts yeah so this happened over a period of 2 years and once that happened and when the shows came out mind you this whole 2 years humne ek dusre ko bahut peeta hmm bahut mara <laughs> bahut ek dusre ko matlab you know so we yeah. kind of like had gone through this whole smoothing of the edges and became a cog yeah we became a clock you know and and we became very good at what we do mm. and this whole singing routine with dancing and all is very tough yeah it may look very easy because there's a no. reverse tack because yeah. your bow is going to say different thing it's another thing sa pakadna when you're sitting down or when you're talking correct but movement ke sath kuch karna is very tough okay yeah. and if you don't do it for one month you're lost mm that's the game and we were at it and tabhi jawani bhi thi theek hai to sab kuch jor jor ke some of the band came out so who all are part of it right now uh, right now currently sudanshu is back on on the game mm. okay but like i don't count him as a matlab because when you count sudanshu and sudanshu is a business class hai nahi hai okay main nahi aa raha so he is in that like wala tum matlab chalam log ja rahe you know so it happens that way so now we are all in this comfortable space so uh, the band still exists we all have our own solo individual careers okay uh-huh. and we all are doing very well in our own respective Zones. ways yeah and as and when the time and the music and the budgets permit mm. all of us are it it's as simple as that mm. that's the long and story of my life <laughs> oh my god that was a very long one thank you but it felt nice to take out all of this so um what was the creative process inside the band uh quite simple um we were playing to our strengths hmm. uh in terms of voices we were chalk and cheese hmm so whose voice is suiting best each song wo wala thai nahi everybody sings everything hmm. and then we do parts so in one song so bander boy sings all the songs okay hmm. we know all the songs but i know two and a half lines of hmm. each song because <laughs> mere baad it's the other guy yeah. and the other guy fails he passes the mic to the audience hmm. so so aisa karte karte humne zindagi nikal di hmm. to hamare paas kuch kuch 
600 covers rahenge mm. if you see and we are a minus one act right yeah because you're already five people on stage four people on stage then yeah. sound engineer manager ye wo photographer social media ye wo tabhi kya tha hum log panch log the that itself was a huge thing uske sath yeah. ek five piece band aur ek manga dun to it becomes 10 people traveling so economics mm. wouldn't make sense and plus everybody is a star so yeah. everybody needs like business class everybody needs like one room for their own so it's four room four bills four this four other bhai ash the us time to we lived mm. it creative process yeah. was not very um the the album the singing in the album or what we're doing was very well handled by Leslie Lewis mm. he would like i remember during production during recording of gori chintu siddharth and i would say sir this harmony sir that harmony sir this yeah. harmony then he would be like <laughs> 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 yeah. And he's got the style, you know. I don't know. He's listening to the song and go. This is how he keeps tempo. <laughs> okay, you'll see his old muscle go like that. And this is how he listens to it. <laughs> and we would button so this harmony, that harmony, this harmony. Thanks. <laughs> I know my job. <laughs> and a uh, lot of the production that I learnt <laughs> has been purely by observing him. Yeah. And he's a great teacher. you know he would like just about give you just enough for your brain to kind of pick up and mm. kind of take stuff from it and thank you sir for a brilliant career mm. and for the wonderful songs mm. and uh, he was instrumental in curating and charting a band of boys career mm. because the music is the first thing that yeah. you speak right then comes yeah. the video the aesthetic the stage sense the look the feel the tone yeah so his creative process was then passed on to okay this i think will be better done by siddharth because he's yeah. got that kind of a voice the thing so he would choose the flow play of who starts who begins who ends in each yeah. song so first whole album which had the biggest hits it had she does me crazy it had ish it had gori meri neen you know and yeah. all these big hits were first like and we spent two years producing it mind you mm. two years was spent on it because there was that much we remember re recording gori Hmm. It was an Octavius. We redid Gori the whole time, the second time over, because it sounded like something else when we were first doing it. And then he said, "No, no, I don't think this is right. You're not doing it the wrong way." All that happened. Second album was done by us, hmm. as in each primitive members of band members, because we all thought we were like, "Arey, who Siddharth Aldipur is, Amar Aldipur's son, Chintu Bosle is, Asha Bosle is grandson. Hmm. I am Shuruki from Rubber Band. Hmm. Karan Over has already released an album. Pandey sings so well. We can do the music ourselves." It hmm. tanked. <laughs> okay, thanked <laughs> brilliantly. Yeah. Okay, and uh, that's when we realized, you know, <laughs> we should go to Leslie again. Third album, we went to Leslie again. Yeah. Okay, and Leslie sir, uh, kind of, I, there's uh, there's a little bit of a thing in the second album. Second album mm. was from a movie, Kiss Kiss Co. Kiss Kiss mm. Co was based on our lives. Okay, so Beatles, Hard Days Night, Spice Girls, huh. that kind of a movie where we are playing ourselves, five idiots. Okay, based on one girl, and that one girl goes to one guy. Mm. It was simple, stupid. We went to Bali, shot it. It was a brilliant two and a half months. We were tanned and crazy, but. We were a fitness bus. Hmm. Rose foam party, rose suba volleyball, rose shamko shoot. So we were living the life. Yeah. अब वो हो गया हम वापस आए हमको लगा हमारी तो मतलब लाइफ हम तो अभी पिक्चर में आने वाले हम तो we are stars. पिक्चर पिट गई. ठीक है. It did one week of business. Okay. And the songs also didn't do well. So we were like अभी क्या करें? <laughs> But our shows were going on. I mean, for yeah. us it was topical. We were still going. Third album. Okay. But that's an interesting thing because. it goes to show that live may if you keep delivering that business keeps coming it doesn't matter what's happening on record consistency is the game yeah when you fail which uh -huh. you will uh -huh. okay you have to just like bear with it chew it and continue okay because only when you do enough of it will the business come to you in auto mode and it comes to you only after 10 years <laughs> One doctor friend of mine who's also a family relative told me this: mm. any profession you're in, if you give ten years to it, the business will start coming to you if you're any good at it. Mm. Till that time, sir, karam karo, beta. Phal ki chinta mat karo. So that's the not the thing. And then we did third album. Third album was again. So in between this, the stage craft mm -hmm. was all internally handled by band boys. We had a choreographer. Danny mm. Fernandez, who's now also a member of a band of boys, if you mm. remember, okay. So Danny was the choreographer. All those Marineen step steps and mm -hmm. all—it's all him. All that choreography was him, and uh, 
what we were on stage and over a period of time after the main songs and the covers and all that we started taking um charge of it ourselves mm. we also learned the business of music as to like so we all would like you know get calls from individual people i still get calls for a band of boys because my numbers in film india and i remember this very categorically when film india mein jab dal rahe the to chindu was like you mad or why are you putting a person i don't want to give my person number but i dal mera person number doesn't matter yeah. thank god i did that thank god i did that Hmm. Okay, so even though it's annoying to sometimes get like, but I do get just sometimes calls. Sir, band boys, bolra hai? Haan, ji, hmm. unka ek member bolra hu. Sir, wo show hai sir, Bareilly mein. Uh, kitna lenge? Acha, okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so you hmm. know, so it happens, but you still hmm. get the calls. Yeah, you still get the calls. Yeah, so. Mm. Abhi, I don't think it's the same. But Abhi, now you better like, uh, please speak to my Sarega, my representative. Mm. <laughs> you know, this this needs to happen now. Do you think a band of boys will happen today? Like, nay nice, say, can a boy band? Can a, a new girl? boy band happen? Yeah, yeah I mean, uh, just about two weeks ago or three weeks mm. ago, I saw a new girl band coming through. Yeah, yeah, and a very band. tight one. Mm. Uh, it's easy to do a boy band, um, but here's mm. the trick: it needs to be one of us mm. leading that kind of a. The same because you need mm. the experience. Mm. Ronan Keating mm. has produced a boy band. Why? Because he has the experience of producing a boy yeah. band. Yeah. Not that Devraj Sanyal can't, mm-hmm. but there's a practical aspect to mm. fine tune the legs and yeah, bells yeah. and whistles of an act that needs to be on the road. Mm. Because it has to have monetary significance. Mm. Otherwise, you're just pumping in money, and you must understand that. In those days, there was no content. Mm. There was yeah. television, and it didn't have any content. So they were dying for content. Mm. MTV had just come out. Channel V had just come out, mm. and they came to us, sir. Why don't you do two songs back to back? Because we have a program called Back to Back. Can you? So we shot music videos in that style. We should shoot two. We shoot yeah. two together so that we have like you know. So that's how it used to be. One year, yeah. four songs. So today it's quite the opposite because now we are competing on content. Yes, and in those mm. days, mm. our songs were played meritoriously. Mm. You would call IBN and say, "Mere ko ye wala gana band of us ka bajao." So mm. there was a demand play. Yeah. Okay, because of which we would go into twelve rotations per day, which is huge mm. from a television point of view. Twelve rotations means that you have twelve hours, twelve hours, huh? Twenty hours from you, you have twelve hours. Viewable hours, you have seven hours, seven hours. In that, you have twelve rotations. Wow. Or twelve hours in twelve hours means every two hours, you have twelve hours. 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 So even now when I go to some remote town, I am so tired, you know. You come to see me, I know. Yeah, I am. In my childhood, you are my very favorite. You are my very favorite. Yeah. So this happens quite a bit. Mm-hmm. Why? Because we were on television, and in those days, content was liberalization just happened. Mm-hmm. All Zika Bouquet had just come out. Sony had just branched mm-hmm. out. You know, so all of these things were just like spirits. So they were dying for content. They were just like spirits. So they were dying for content. They were just like spirits. So they were dying for content. They were just like spirits. So they were dying for content. They were just like spirits. Musically, the first album. They were saying, "Sir, आप लोग ना सिर्फ सिर्फ शो का ध्यान रखो. The album, the jacket, उसके अंदर का content, उसमें क्या लिखने वाला है, उसके photographer, उसका ये album मिलने, ये वो सब कुछ उन्होंने ध्यान दिया. Even Universal Music. Very nice ecosystem. It was an ecosystem. There was literally an A&R guy who used to handle this thing correctly. Yeah, yeah. अब क्या है पता है? अब इतना content है. Hmm. To rise through the content, you to literally be very good. Yeah. Okay, and consistent, and marketing might, and marketing might. Okay, mm-hmm. so you have to be seen. Mm-hmm. Okay, you have to be very good at what you do, mm-hmm. and you have to be consistent. In three numbers, one place, where you have failed, you have failed. Because it's difficult to maintain the facade. Yeah. So I believe it's tougher now. Hmm. Our time, what was it? TV, we saw. Second day, show, we saw. Third day, we had a nap. I find as I'm growing older, mm-hmm. it's becoming tougher. Hmm. Because I'm competing with a prati quad who's come like day before yesterday, <laughs> and I'm not complimenting or uh, dissing his style. Hmm. It works. Tere ti tu 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 tu. Ye tabi kada. Uh huh. It worked that time. So audience is never wrong. Vishal yeah. Dalan told me this. Audience is never wrong. Yeah. Aap galat ho. 
you're not able to do it, right? Because you're not able to tap into the audience and you're trying to make songs which are still in the 2000 ka time. Mm. Ka. Obviously, nobody's going to like tune in. Gen Z does not want complexity. Why? Because they already feel very, oh my God, the world is so complex. We just need to chill. Mm. Right? Tumhari time pe kya tha? Please, augmented it, go. Please, diminish it, go. Yes. Right? Maza bhi aata tha. Right? Yeah. Right? Okay. Kitne raag aate? Do? Haan, sir. Right? Achcha. Aau. Se saap akado do saal. Right? From that to like, yeah, I mean, take a plug in, <laughs> patch it in, you know, and put some impulse in there. Oh, now we have beat oven. Mm. Okay, all right. Mr. Siddharth Bharadwaj, great friend of mine though. Yeah. Okay, got 11 crore funding. Oh, really? Two days ago. Oh. Okay, and he's working on something which every musician is probably going to benefit from. I know the new kids are going to. I know my son is going to. Mm. You and I, Hmm. who spent our best years trying to figure out what's the difference between C and C microtonal sharp. <laughs> okay. Okay. Hmm. Is now going to try and figure out how to just like drop a plugin, write hmm. a certain prompt and get that whole patch ready-made for you and then do an edit to that and then condense it and then deliver this. Hmm. And hey, at some point of time, it's going to become like an ecosystem where physically playing an instrument is going to become... A renaissance thing. Yeah. Like it's going to have a big premium. It's Yeah. It's going to have a very big premium. And that artist is going to be, that clan is going to come down. Mm. During our time, the engineering problem was very simple. Five floor building, okay, mm. has a hundred liter tank on the terrace. Mm. Okay. Water is falling at, uh, at the rate at so and so, so and so speed. Mm. Gravity is at nine point blah, 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 blah. This, okay. Mm. How much time will it take for first floor tank to fill second floor to tank, third floor to tank? Mm. This was the question. Oh, don't know. Now we have to do our own relation. Scientific calculator. Maki mm. Our formulas both alag alag and we have to conjure your own answer. Mm. This was the kind of things that, because these were the real world problems that we had to do. Yeah. Yesterday, I had to produce a video using Unreal Engine, which is what I do in the studio. Mm -hmm. Okay. Where I had to produce the end frame and the start frame to Kuchalti, the latest song that I've yeah, done. Yeah. Okay. And which is at 100 BPM. Mm. I went to chat GP and told me what should be the starting point of a camera object moving from point A to point B. If the song is at 132 seconds mm. at 100 BPM. Unit UUE, Unreal Engine Unit 2904. I start point zero, I end point 2904. Mm. This would have not been possible yeah. five years ago. Yeah. So, the same problem mm. is not a situational calculation by an engineer anymore. The engineer is already online. Mm. Everything is documented. Mm. All textures in the world are mapped. Okay, every question to every problem is already solved. Okay, mm -hmm. and now you have tools all waiting. It's going to be the creative way in which you take this tool and this tool and solve another kind and another league of problems, mm -hmm. thereby creating jobs in that direction. Similarly, yeah. for musicians, caudal structures that we know of, okay, mm -hmm. it will stay. Okay, yeah. but applying that onto newer plugins, newer, newer interfaces. Newer designs is mm -hmm. where the next set of musicians are going to go. Because mm -hmm. the rudimentary job of kick, snare, hi-hat at 8 by 9 count at <laughs> at 40 BPM mm. for a trip-hop song mm. with ethereal landscape mm. is conjured by this text prompt that I just gave. Mm. So the bass work is already going to be there. But yeah. now the melody line is something which... What is that musician who plays on the iPad? Rago. Mm. Okay. Anand Mahindra gave a Twitter... This thing to him about a week ago. Mm. So, so the batch of musicians are going to go there. Mm. Which may be interesting. Yeah. Because it is interesting. But now again, because there are many such guys. Mm. To break through the clutter is going to be even tougher. Exactly like how it was then also. Mm. But us tarik pe ek Baba Segal bhi nikla tha. Mm. Is tarik, is batch pe ek Hani Singh bhi nikla tha. Mm. Or nikalne wale nikal jate hain. Kabhi kisi kisi ka ek kachra ho jata hai. Kisi kisi ka mm. achha ho jata hai. You never know. Anup Jalota ji said something in the latest um, Isamra meeting. Like ye ek time pe ek auzhar aaya tha jiska naam tha keyboard. Mm. Hum log sab bole ki kya hone wala ye keyboard ke wajah se. Mm. Hamari sab ki nokriya chali jayegi. Kuch nahi hua. ठीक इसी तरह ये AI जो है 
<laughs> इससे कुछ नहीं होना है मेरी आवाज में अगर वो कुछ करते हैं तो बहुत अच्छी बात है आई थिंक ऑल मॉडर्न टेक्नोलॉजी आर टूल्स वी जस्ट नीड टू गेट अराउंड टू What are some of the mental models towards uh, maneuvering your career as a musician, artist, and uh, keeping? What is your thought process around your artistic identity? You have to be unique. Hmm. So if one goes into a herd mentality, acha abhi arigi chal rahe to arigi to alag aate hmm. sab. Usme aap phas jaoge. Yeah. Um. You there is a lot of fighting on the tide. and um trend chasing doesn't work ha huh, matlab you have to make your own therefore when i first heard your song you and mano were doing that thing that's when i said ye mere uh, mere school of thought mein se hai nahi but it's mm. different mm. so thereby you created a niche of your own yeah. right it's microtonal it's got mm. it's got its own it's minimalistic it reminded me of idm mm. intelligent dance music you know a brain dance it reminded me of all that mm. so it's got a it's got a market of its own but then you have to make your own market being a musician is all about peacocking <laughs> it is all right mm. and at one point of time we all just wanted to get laid right that was the only <laughs> thing okay but now i think it is it is like look as i said at one point of time they said sir aap sirf gana banao baki sab hum karenge mm. abhi ke time pe matlab gana to humko bana nahi hai audio video mastered product mm. is a given marketing plan radio plan bus bags billboards mm. पब्लिसिटी पी आर एडिट्स उसके बाद आएगा वीडियो ओ वीडियो का फिर बाद में प्रोसेस उसका स्क्रीन प्ले उसका डिरेक्शन उसका सब कुछ एवरी थिंग इज इन योर ओन हैंड्स अकाउंट्स वन थिंग ऑल म्यूजिशियन शुड लर्न अकाउंट्स ओके हम लोग इतना मतलब आर्टिस्ट्री चेज करने जाते हैं ना मतलब हमको उसकी गणित समझ में नहीं आती हमको म्यूजिक का गणित समझ में आता है लेकिन हम लोग को अकाउंट्स नहीं समझ आई अग्री थोड़ा इकोनॉमिक्स अकाउंट्स आना चाहिए आना चाहिए बिकॉज उसके बिना हम लोग ख्याली पुलाव में घूमते हैं कि मतलब हाँ हाँ गाना तो बन जाएगा कोई भी डिसेंट गाना बनाने में आपके चालीस हजार रुपये जाने जाने हैं मिक्स वाला इंजीनियर आपसे दस हजार लेगा मैंने कोई भी डिसेंट वाला ठीक है एक सेशन म्यूजिक लेगा पाँच एक स्टूडियो अगर कहीं आपको बुक करना है वहाँ जाएंगे पाँच से दस पर घंटा आठ सौ रुपये हजार रुपये ऐसा कुछ तो जाएगा इफ यू हैव ए ओन सेटअप यू रीच दे देन Mm. Okay, then you're relying on one heavy musician to kind of pull everything. Everything else you're producing, yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Okay, then you're doing mm. all that, and you got one great sarod player to do stuff. Mm. All right, who's cost you fifteen grand? Mm. Oh, all right, it's an anthem. Okay, I can charge seventy five. I will call voiceover के लिए पंद्रह. ठीक है कोई Suzy को बुलाए पंद्रह तीस वहाँ चलेगे. हाथ में बसता क्या? Yeah. Oh, उसके में GST भी है. Sorry. Yeah. GST gaya, theek hai. So from a packet of seventy-five to hundred k, hmm. which is what any competing musician, including the A and the B rungs of today's yeah. ad film world, yeah. are charging. Why? Because the difference is they're doing ten more like that. Hmm. Right. So all the big studios, we're not we're not doing anything less than them, hmm. work-wise, quality-wise. I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah. A brief is a brief. Uske sabse chaddi banana hai. Yeah. Theek hai and. an intelligent musician will be able to very easily like do this completely on your own mm-hmm. or get a couple of session musicians and get a mix master and out of the play the difference mm-hmm. between the ones who are already there and the ones who are getting there is the fact that they are able to handle their clients better mm. and how are they able to handle the clients better because they have the body of work behind them how did the body of work come behind them because they started small mm. because they made the price at 30k 30k went to 100k mm. and Did a lot of it. Did a lot of it. Did a lot. Of it, and it, as a musician or as an artist, whether you are a performing artist, whether you are a teaching artist, or whether yeah. you are a producer artist, mm. okay, uh, you have to be able to sleep at night saying, "I did what they wanted, but the way I wanted it." Mm. And this yeah. is the constant fight. And this is the fine line that we're always walking, right? Yeah. मेरा ही सिग्नेचर गया लेकिन थोड़ा उनके ट्विक के हिसाब से उनका गोल पोस्ट के हिसाब से गया आई लिव विद दैट वहां से करते करते पर रोज करना है एंड समटाइम्स इट्स द प्रिमाइस व्हिच गेट्स यू द जॉब ओ मेरे पास स्टूडियो आई गॉट अ टेरेस आई गॉट दिस दैट नो दैट हां ठीक है ओ इट्स कूल प्लेस टू चिल या सिट सर आई विल मेक द म्यूजिक वेयर एज मे बी अ मोर क्वालिफाइड म्यूजिशियन सिटिंग इन अ बेडरूम सेटअप मोर गीकी हु इज प्रोबब्ली एबल टू नेल इट बेटर इन टर्म्स ऑफ कॉर्डल स्ट्रक्चर्स has not gotten the job because he does not know how to sell the song mm. so every mm. creative pursuit needs monetary support yeah. without which don't do it mm. so don't go into music as a field if you say your mum 
वेरी गुड बेटा आप बहुत अच्छा गा लेते हो आपको टीवी पे होना चाहिए प्लीज वॉक अवे फ्रॉम दैट गेट पीपल हु डोंट नो यू टू कॉमेंट ऑन योर म्यूजिकलिटी बिकॉज दैट्स अ रियलिटी स्लैब दैट यू ऑल गेट ओके सो और बी वेरी जुनूनोफाइड अबाउट इट कि मुझे इतना पसंद है म्यूजिक आई डोंट गिव अ रैच सैस आई एम स्टिल डूइंग इट देन आई दू नीड सपोर्ट ऑफ म्यूजिशियन फ्रेंड्स फैमिली और माई वाइफ यू नो वो से बेटा तू कर मैं हूँ तेरे पीछे एंड दैट इज हैपन टू मी क्वाइट अ बिट वॉज माई रॉक नॉट इन प्लेस ओके आई वुड डाइड ओके बिकॉज देर मेनी पिटफॉल्स इन बिटवीन देर सो मेनी टाइम्स आई पिक माई सेल्फ आप कि यार दस साल करियर बैंड ऑफ बॉयज का चल तो गया अभी ना ऑल ऑफ अस आर बोर्ड ऑफ इट टू थाउजेंड टेन नाउ वी डोंट सी अदर फेसेस वी आर ऑल स्ट्रगलिंग विद ऑन सोनिक आइडेंटिटी मैं क्या करूँ वट केम आफ्टर बैंड ऑफ बॉयज सो बैंड ऑफ बॉयज इज स्टिल ऑन पेपर अलाइव बट लाइक फ्रॉम टू थाउजेंड टू थाउजेंड टेन आई सेन लाइफ बुकलेट फुल पैंटीज थ्रो स्टेज वी आर लिविंग द गुड लाइफ ओके टू थाउजेंड टेन ऑनवर्ड क्या शनि दशा ना वो डू वी डू ओके ऑल फेल्ट लाइक वी ऑल नीड टू लाइक वी ग्रोन बियॉन्ड अ पैंटीज ओके वी ऑल नीड टू लाइक आइडेंटिफाई विद अ ओन थिंग वी ऑल नीड अ ओन सॉनिक सिग्नेचर्स बैंड कैन टू हिट पॉप वॉज गेटिंग केल्ड बाय बॉलीवुड ओके एंड ऑल दोज थिंग्स वो हैपनिंग सो वी ऑल वर ट्राइंग टू फिगर आउट ओन वे चिन टू लेफ द बैंड ही वेंट एंड जॉइन रेडियो एफ एम दैट कैन किल द बैंड बेट एंड आफ्टर दैट सो दैट वेंट इन टू अ लिटिल बिट ऑफ अ डार्क सोन बिकॉज हिज सिस्टर वॉज नॉट फीलिंग वेल ही नो बी विद बैंड बॉयज एनी मो सो द बैंड कैन टेकिंग अ हिट then sudanchu was never there any which was sudanchu left after the second album so mm. the sudanchu came for a bit and then went back and that was the time when i was going through a huge depression for myself that's how mm. i lost my hair mm. so there's a story there when 2000 to 10 to 11 to 12 to 13 i was trying to figure out kya karu singing karu acting karu dancing karu samajh mein nahi aa raha hai modeling karu ye wo this that ball jhad rahe band boys is not doing so well shows utne ho nahi rahe khud ka album karna hai singing karna hai kya karu nahi samajh mein aa raha this despite having like that incredible that's the problem yeah. itna incredible hai na uske aage niche nahi ja sakta mm okay so whatever the next that i do has to be on par or better yeah in comes a show called mtv drive with nano when i'm sitting mm. in a car with four idiots okay packed <laughs> in a sardine tank called the nano yeah. okay we were going across the whole country and mm. i was part of the east so we were called nano east this is the mm. first reality show the web show web series that came out from mtv called mtv drive with nano and mm. we were nano east starts from visakhapatnam goes all the way till sikkim Mm. Beautiful journey, excellent. What an opportunity! मैं एल्बम बनाऊंगा. On the way, <laughs> laptop, sound card, mic, mic, सब लेके. जो mm. आजकल जो आप इंस्टाग्राम पे देखते हो, मैं yeah. मतलब 2011, 13, 13 में किया मैंने. Mm. 12 में किया ये मैंने. And I'm going through this whole. क्या करूँ? मुझे समझ में नहीं आ रहा है. Life ये वो फलाना डिंका सब चल रहा है. You were already married. Yeah, yeah. And with a child. 2003 with a child, yeah. ओके सो आई एम सो तो मिड लाइफ क्राइसिस का फर्स्ट पार्ट आ रहा है ऐसा बिकॉज लग रहा है ठीक है एंड नाउ व्हेन यू आर टू मंथ्स ऑन द रोड योर फेस बिकम्स लाइक द रोड और राइट एंड लाइक यू नो सो एंड आई टेक ऑन द शो एंड देन ऑन द रोड व्हेन यू हैव लाइक नो चांस ऑफ लाइक यू नो स्प्रूसिंग योर सेल्फ अप एंड यू गोट डिजेवल्ड है तो जो उगाए हैं वो बहुत अच्छे उग रहे हैं बट जो जा रहे हैं वो एकदम जा रहे तो इतना मैं प्लक चिकन लग रहा था मैं ठीक है एंड आई जस्ट डेंट वॉन्ट टू लुक दैट डिसेबल्ड आई रीच देवराली मोनिस्ट्री इन सिक्किम इट्स अ वेरी हैवी प्लेस इट्स ऑन बिग थिंग इट्स अस्ट मंक प्लेस एंड आई सी अम मंक एन एरिक दैट्स माई लुक आई गो टू द मंक Like you, my watch. I said, "Tiag din hai." You know, it's not just like that. Tiag din hai. He said, "He skinned me." Mm. I gave him my watch. I sat there for four hours. I sang mm. every rag I know, mm. and I cried. Mm. I come down, and my mm. friends say, "You look relieved." Mm. So that point onwards, it was a new phase for me. No fame, no shame. Mm. It was like a full reset point for me. I remember coming back to Bombay with renewed vigor. Mm-hmm. Okay, I had some crazy ideas about how I should look, feel, tone, write, mm. and that's when all the electronica came. Because in that 2010 mm. to 2012, 13, 14, mm. 15, I wrote one song, Badal. I went through some 15 iterations of it. Whatever I learnt on YouTube, I applied mm. to that song. Mm. Oh no, not working okay. again. Again, next plugin I learnt. Again, I applied to that song. Mm. Okay, you understand what I'm saying? So it's yeah, when you're suddenly learning production through a great teacher called YouTube. Yeah. All right. Whatever you learn, you're trying to apply to that song. <laughs> and that's how from an acoustic organic song it became mm. a electronic sci-fi po- poetry soul song. Mm. 
and i released it in finally in 2014 hmm okay so it it went through that that level of like hmm. changes and and because this whole i had a sea change of personality and like there was so much going on i went through this whole catharsis yeah you know i went through this whole like okay now a new silk worm has come out now bed and butterfly is going to happen you know all mm-hmm. that and and from that point onwards it just became all about learning technology all about supporting myself mm-hmm. it then i even went to the extent of having a, a base act called the liquid base project Hmm. I remember yeah, this. So yeah. So like you know, I went dived hmm. into that. I call it liquid base because, hmm. pata nahi base ka sound hmm. to change hone, but base rehne wala hai. At some point of time or the other. So liquid base, jo bhi hmm. base hai, na absorb kar lenge isa. Hmm. So glitch hop had just come out. So I was hmm. I was tripping on trip hop, glitch hop, all these like you know new age forms are coming out. I was experimenting a lot. Hmm. Got I remember getting all all kinds of uh, interesting new producers on board. Like you know hmm. who are more prolific than I am on Ableton. Hmm. You know to kind of like get me this whole bell and whistle. And I was working towards this whole live electronic act where my vocals go through a processing chain, which hmm. is coming out live. And I am on in years all throughout. And I'm this doing, is what 2015. 16? This is 2015. Yeah. This is 2014, 15, 16. Yeah. Badal got an award. Badal hmm. got an award from Artists Award at one wow. point of time. So it, so so I went through this whole catharsis where I didn't need a band, I didn't need anybody else. I am me myself, hmm. army on stage. So I enjoyed that whole army on stage. Did that for about fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and then I went through all the clubs. So I was doing a ton of club gigs. Ye bees, thirty thousand wali gigs. Yeah, ton of club gig, club gig. You know, all Pune, all Indore, all all MP, all Delhi, all Calcutta. Mm. Jitne bhi clubs hote hain, jo ye DJs ko kitne dete hain log. Mm. Very shitty small market, but mm. I went through that to try and understand because I saw that the Husseins and the Asads of the world are still mm. gigging. Yeah. Okay, but the Sunita Rao's and the Lucky Ali's are not gigging. Hmm. The bander boys are not gigging. Hmm. So how do I gig? Okay, let's go and try and. Mix track A plus B and press play. Hmm. Hey, I can sing with it also. Uh, processing is not so hot. Yeah. Okay, let's get a processor in between. करते 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 I made a rig of my own called Trackleton. I think you was witness yeah. to that called Trackleton. You know because Trackel which is tractor and Ableton Trackleton. Yeah. ऐसा करके मेरे एक ऐसा बहुत बड़ा ऐसा rig विक सब बना के I explored that whole live electronic aspect hmm. till about 2017 when I met Varki Patani, my current manager, who said ये क्या ब्रो तू लैपटॉप के नीचे झुक झुक के काम कर रहा है काम नहीं करना है शो परफॉर्म कर रहा है स्टेज पे कर तो रहा नहीं 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 then he got hmm. me back from that to the current life scenario where i've got like an entourage behind me and i'm hmm. doing the hero song hmm. the face is the money you know yeah. you know the voice is the king you know that yeah. to come back to what it was that way and that's how we that's how i turned myself around hmm that's been the right wow so constant evolution yeah keeping up staying relevant <laughs> using tech yeah but you know tech has always been like the game changer thing in music like right now it is the game changer in all the hmm. industries but like a 100 years ago so tech was only causing all the change yes. uh, piano roll se aage aage with the gramophone and then the correct yeah you perform hmm. quite a bit hmm. you are an awesome performer you but you also have a great network how have you built that network and what what is the main aspect of music business that solo or uh, you know emerging artists should focus on it kind of boils down to in my opinion one thing you're selling art mm. but you're selling entertainment to be honest mm. and somebody is always going to be a better peacock than you mm. okay and uh, the specific field of artistry that we belong to which is music yeah. there is always better music than yours somewhere yeah. else yeah okay so amar haldipur ji had told me something which is very pertinent to this question of yours yeah. accomplished violin player yeah. lakshmikant parallel arrangement yeah. all done by him okay sir bolte hain ki dekho gana likhna hmm. writing gana compose karna hmm. gana arrange karna gana record karna gana produce karna गाना मिक्स करना गाना मास्टर करना ये सब ना एक आदमी कर सकता है लेकिन आपको आपको गाना गाना बेचने नहीं आया ना खत्म दिस होल एफर्ट इज गोइंग टू वेस्ट सो यू हैव टू बी एबल टू सेल द आर्ट या दैट्स व्हाई द नंबर्स आर इंपॉर्टेंट दैट्स व्हाई एन आशु द वॉटन स्कूल ऑफ बिज यू नो सो दैट्स व्हाई आई से अकाउंट्स इज अ लिटिल इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर पीपल टू अंडरस्टैंड यू डोंट हैव टू बी अ फैंटास्टिक म्यूजिशियन Mm. But you have to be a fantastic salesperson. Mm. 
if you want your music out to the masses i mean yeah. think about it i don't think bachcha's music is that hot mm. great sale yeah i don't think anu malik made fantastic music greatest sale mm. one guy who is a very big salesman and at the same time very big talent is dadlani mm. great pipes great yeah. sale great music yeah so that fine line shankar ji yeah you get what i'm yeah, driving yeah, at yeah, right yeah, okay yeah. so i think the sale point is very important for all musicians mm. so to answer your question i think this network yeah okay has to be on the forefront so if you're not vibing with a fellow artist slash audience mm. slash whoever and you're mm. making music only for yourself why are you doing it mm then you're a geek then you're like then you're just like then you're not selling art you're just like doing it you're like picasso bhooka maroge aap hm uske baad jab aap mar jaoge tab wo art bikne wala hai hm wahan mat jao hm there is enough depression in the world and those renaissance periods are already done with you know nowadays you don't need to be a picasso hm what would you like to say to your peers i'm not trying to say something but i'm not poor but i'm broke most of the time that's because i am pushing myself to reinvest in me mm. and that takes a big toll mm. and it's the same with everybody who's successful mm. wow so everybody thinks like you know like we've arrived mm. nobody's arrived You're, they're all still getting there because in their head the arrival is still there mm. where is it that you want to go I think every artist needs to or wants to reach a point where they become irrelevant to the system and the system feeds them. Mm. To get there is a big struggle. Shankar ji, mm. in spite of being a zillionaire, is still working, you know? Yeah. Does he need to work? No. Why is he still working? Joy. I mean, yeah, it's in theory, yes. Yeah. Okay, there is joy in service production. मतलब घर पे बैठ के क्या करेंगे? वो बोलने वाली बात है. Hmm. But when you build an ecosystem so large, I mean, to feed so many mouths, you have to work that much more. Hmm. So all the successful people are always still getting somewhere, which hmm. is to the other person who's seeing it, he's already there. Hmm. But in his head, he has to get somewhere else. and it may not necessarily a monetary platform or a reach that he's yeah, reaching yeah, to yeah. could be spiritual could be a joyous level that he's trying to reach yeah but for which he's still working prasun joshi told me something very interesting once in a flight mm. in india if you have to be a musician you have to constantly churn mm. i have to keep writing new things i have to keep releasing new things i have to keep doing something or there to stay relevant mm. javed sahab is still doing it mm. तो हम कौन है भाई सो आई बिलीव दैट ऑल माई पेयर्स ओके कम ऑन लेजली सर माई मेंटो इन लाइफ ही इज स्टिल गिगिंग एंड ट्राइंग टू बी रेलिवेंट नॉट बिकॉज ही वॉन्ट्स ओनली जॉय ही कैन लाइक पैकअप इफ यू वॉन्ट्स टू बट नो इट वॉन्ट वर्क बिकॉज ही इज मेड एन इको सिस्टम फॉर हिम सेल्फ एंड देर आर मेनी लेग्स टू इट एंड देर आर मेनी मोर फॉर द लैक ऑफ अ बेटर वर्ड माउथ टू फील Mm. So to keep all that relevant, you have to still continuously keep doing what you're doing. And if you don't do that, then mm. you are nirvana. <laughs> then you're cut kabhi. Mm. And I don't think that lifestyle will work. Yeah. In today's date. What are you working on right now? I'm working on my own music videos, which has been six years since I released anything new. Oh. 2018 just before the pandemic is when i released kya raaz hai tu zindagi okay uh-huh. which and post that i was going to go to making more songs with the circuit and this whole idea of getting more musicians on board so i can get ankit to play a classical mm. piece and that's mm. a song yeah. and then the next musician to play and that's where the ecosystem yeah. was being built at andheri and yeah. that's when the pandemic hit and i went into service production yeah. and then i did service production till now mm. till i became a saregama artist mm. and now i went to them with a the song mm. i said sir this is a song called keh do mm. it's my next biggest hit mm. let's put it out तो ही टेल्स मी सर बहुत अच्छा गाना है लेकिन आपके स्पॉटिफाई पे तो फोर्टी फाइव लिस्नर्स है बोला तो 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 ही सर ऐसा नहीं चलेगा मैं बोला यार तुमने गोल पोस्ट चेंज कर दिया 
हमारे टाइम पे टीवी पे आता था मैं अभी भी बहुत गाँव खड़े में जाता तो मेरे को लोग पहचान लेते हैं बिकॉज आई एम ऑन समू आई एम ऑन सम टेलीविजन सीरियल माई लेटेस्ट कैंपस बीच इज ऑन एयर राइट नाउ ओके सो पीपल रिकनाइज मी फ्रॉम दे कम एंड टेक सेल्फीज सो आई एम अ टी वी आर्टिस्ट हू देन वेन यू वन आई वॉज रिलीजिंग एल्बम एन आई वेन सोलो यू सेड यूट्यूब एंड आई डिड यूट्यूब एंड आई यूट्यूब में मैंने कुछ कर दिया नाउ यू टेलिंग मी स्पॉटिफाई सो यू आर चेंजिंग द गोल पोस्ट एवरी टाइम सो दे पुट फाइव हुप्स इन फ्रंट ऑफ यूसेड सर पाँच कवर्स करते हैं आप आपकी तरफ से करो फुल छूट देते हैं आपको आप कर लो आपको जैसा करना है उसके बाद हम रिलीज करते हैं so mm-hmm. that's where i'm right right now and i released recently i released a song yeah. called na tum jaano na hum from kahuna pyare yeah. okay and i've done it my way i made a lo-fi version which is what works i'm mm-hmm. on the first video of that and i'm using virtual production which is a big muscle that i have mm-hmm. and only i have and i'm trying to do something unique and nobody seeing the uniqueness yeah. they're saying ha sir theek hai beech pe jaake shoot karte na no virtual production mein shoot karte and i'm trying to sell it and i know i'll do something about it it'll work i hope mm-hmm. it works because then i have to do four more such like that and then mm-hmm. i will come to my original so by the year and you will see one original song by which before which there'll be five other songs so from 45 listeners my spotify has jumped to 30k listeners <laughs> so so the struggle mm. is real mm. so now i have a new goal post i hope the mm. goal post doesn't change by the time i reach my fifth song yeah. okay which it very well might mm. during our times we were like making songs which is like most energetic most cut through most sab kuch falana dinka mm. and it has to like you know we have to write six songs and you know out of which uh, four are going to be the runaway hit okay and yeah. then we're going to go on tour and that's your one hour of a show and that's how we drive Correct. right okay yeah. no now more chill mm. more pleasant more le- you know less intrusive it has yeah. to be background also at the same time mm. i have to be able to study to it while i'm like mm. listening to music so when i'm making these songs the advice that is coming from the listening team in sarega masters said don't make it edgy make it lo-fi mm. and that's what's going on and that's the way the world is perceiving music right now it's a different thing what you do on the live gig mm. but your repertoire is now decided by the spotify playlist editor mm. are you understanding where your career is at <laughs> <laughs> that's what's going on wow that was uh that was quite something <laughs> sharin <laughs> thank you so much for making the time and sharing so much my god uh, i had so much fun doing this <laughs> at this hour and uh, yeah keep in touch keep coming back <laughs> i will i will and i hope i have not given you enough to edit i mean i have I- I know I have given you enough <laughs> no, to edit, it, okay? <laughs> and I hope it's just not a task, okay? Yeah. Thank you for having me, and I wish you all the best. Keep yeah. at it. 